What is up you guys? It's Mackenzie. Welcome back to my channel or nice to meet you if you're new. I post college and lifestyle content so if that's something you're interested in make sure you subscribe down below. We are very chaotic energy today um, but I'm a little bit I'm a little bit conflicted okay because my back camera on my phone is now not working and my camera decided to not work again but I have grad pictures coming up tomorrow night and I feel like that's a memory that I need to vlog so here we are front camera quality iPhone uh, X quality I do have a new phone coming in but of course it won't get here until tomorrow night after the pictures are done so I'm feeling conflicted because is it still gonna be worth vlogging if it's not high quality I think the answer is yes now it is 12:51, the day before my grad pictures and I'm going to get a dress <laughs> so like me to literally wait until the day before to look for an outfit so like who knows if I'm even gonna be able to find one um so that's just why I'm a little chaotic right now because I have work tonight so it's not like I can spend all afternoon shopping and I have class this morning but we're gonna make it work so I am first going to run to Target because although she is not giving bougie grad pick vibes, she's giving cute summer white sundress vibes. And if I can make those vibes work, we're going to be good. We're going to be good. So I'm starting the grad pick vlog now so you guys can be along for the whole journey to get ready with me. I'm getting my nails done tomorrow, spray tan tomorrow. We're going to be fixing the hair, the makeup. We're going to be picking up lashes. We're doing all of it. Because you only graduate college once, unless you get your master's. But I don't know if I'm going to do that. Also, just so you guys can see what I'm working with, this is my back camera right now. This is my back camera. So, yeah. <laughs> but here I am, about to pull in to Target to pick up my dress. I say pick up, like, I know if they're even going to have one that I can wear. <laughs> I'm literally getting stress hives on my arms. Like, this is what my life has come to. Welcome to senior year. But we're vlogging so I can look back at myself and be like, why did you do that, Mackenzie? So, you guys get to come along too. Okay, so I am back home now. I just spent way too much money at Target. Um, and don't really know I'm in bed. But that is what I get for waiting to the last minute. Um, so now I say I learned my lesson. But let's be real, I probably didn't. So we're going to do the little Target haul. And then next time I will talk to you guys will probably be tomorrow once it's actually grad pictures day. I'm all over the place. I am in the process of possibly trying to buy a camera right now. So we might have a quality switch by the time we get to tomorrow. But we shall see. So, I just feel like this is like the real life. Like my last few vlogs lately have just been like the real, real. Like this is as real as it gets over here. So I am trying out some new lashes. You can have grad pictures with all the lashes. So these are the Kiss So Real, my lab but better. So we're trying these out. And then of course I just had to get some lash glue. And then I got a pair of heels that I'm probably going to wear for both of my outfits tomorrow. So these are the heels, super on trend right now, super cute. I love the square toe. I actually have them in my size, which is great. And these are great because I will get multiple uses out of them. Everything I bought just for pictures, I will end up wearing again and just won't be posting about it. So that is the great thing about all of these pieces is that I know I did spend a lot of money. <laughs> But that's how I can justify it, by saying that I'm going to use them again. So, here are the shoes in all their glory. Yes, I am a walking size 9 foot. I'm a tall gal, tall gal, okay? Then for the outfits, these are the bottoms. So, it's a matching set. 
thing. It's a green silk, which I thought green would be pretty for FBCU's colors. It's not the same exact green, but it's green. So they are perfect. I was scared that they were going to be too short on me because they're a medium. And usually I have to get a large in pants just because I am so tall. But these are actually perfect. Thank God fitting rooms are open right now. And then these are the, these are, this is the matching top. So it's just like a cute little silk cami. Um, I'm absolutely obsessed with it. And then the dress reveal. Ah, it's literally nothing fancy. It's literally just a plain white dress. Um, I was going to go a little bit more on the scandalous side. There was one that had my cutouts right here. And I would have totally done it, but there was a fat cutout on the boobs. And girl talk, real talk here. I am already self-conscious of my boobs. That's why I really don't wear that much revealing stuff. Because I can now be defeated and all like them. So... <laughs> Literally trauma dumping on you guys. Um, but yeah, so this is the dress. It's about knee length, knee length on me. And yeah, I got it 25, 30 bucks. So, and I will definitely be wearing that again. Um, obviously not for pictures, but for church or other nice occasions. So yeah, that was my little <laughs> Tarje haul. I am going to talk to you guys tomorrow. Hopefully we have a camera quality switch by then. We shall quality see. change in three, two, one. What is up you guys? Welcome to the real world vlog now. I got a Canon G7X and I am amazed at even the difference of quality between my Canon PowerShot and the Canon G7X. Like, it is literally insane that it's the same brand of camera because the quality is totally different. But it is officially grad picture day. I have my camera, my new phone comes in today. We are it's just gonna be a good day i can feel it so it is about eight o'clock now i have my spray tan at 10 so i will probably talk to you guys then because not much is gonna happen before that obtaining to grab pictures okay scratch that i am going to go ahead and steam my gown my stole and my outfits for today because i'm just sitting here doing nothing so i figured i might as well do something semi-productive while i wait for my spray tan obviously the silk outfit i think i did yeah i did a haul yesterday so you guys could see everything but i don't think you've seen my gown yet um so this is her in all her glory she has um blue sleeves and then it just says florida gulf coast university on the sleeve and then on my stole it just says at gco so they still look wrinkly. I'm not sure if my steamer is just not good enough or what. 
but I think I am going to go ahead and get my nails done. I forgot I had to get them done today, so I was just going to go straight to my spray tan. Um, but I think I want to get my nails done first because I don't wear a bra after my spray tan. And I think it would be really awkward to be sitting in the nail salon without a bra. So we are going to go do that and then get my spray tan. And hopefully it has enough time to sit and develop before pictures tonight but we will see what happens all right you guys just got home from my spray tan and getting my nails done these are the nails how cute are they i wanted something super classy and simple that would go with both the outfits didn't want anything like bright and colorful and i have been wanting to try the almond shape because everyone is doing it now and i was like you know I think I need to hop on the trend because it just looks so classy and chic to me and they're also my nails for my birthday which is tomorrow so I am all tanned I'm gonna let it sit for a few hours and then once I shower we can start getting ready so I know it looks wonky now but it will look better once it's set in <laughs> That just looks great, but I promise it will not look that bad once I scrub it off and get in my outfits and everything. It's always how it looks, and I get so stressed out because I'm like, oh my gosh, the tan looks terrible, and then it ends up looking normal once I rinse. So, it is about 12 now, 11.53. I don't need to start getting ready until like 4.30. Pictures aren't until 6.45, so I'm pretty much just gonna work on homework until I have to get ready. So we'll talk to you guys then. So guess what I did not do? Any homework. But I did just spend the last hour cleaning out my 700 TikTok drafts because I'm getting a new phone today. And I remembered, praise Jesus, that um, your TikTok drafts don't save. Like they save to your phone, but they don't save to the app. So I went through all 700. I posted the ones that I liked just for me to only me. And then I posted like the funny old memory ones to my friends only. And then I posted like the content that I had filmed to be for my niche on TikTok. I just went ahead and posted them all today. So if you follow me on TikTok, apologies, cause y'all just got like McKinsey face overload. But instead of doing homework, um, I decided I'm gonna try and tweeze my eyebrows because they are a hot mess. Um, I haven't gotten them done since like 2020, I think. Um, so it's literally been two years since I've gotten my eyebrows waxed. Um, so I'm trying to find my tweezers. I'm not going to be able to make them look perfect, obviously, because I'm just doing it with tweezers and there's a lot of extra hair, but I'm going to do the best I can if I can find my tweezers. I'm going to sit on my toilet and do them because I feel like this is just going to take a concentration that is not standing. Really bringing you guys along for the, the the full grad pick experience today, so I hope you enjoy it. First, we're going to start with the middle because that is the most embarrassing. Because I have really thick black hair. And so it quite literally starts looking like a unibrow. I honestly can't really see that well. I'm just kind of pulling at nothing right now. I forgot how painful it was to get the big hairs. <sighs> they're like thick and in there, so they're like not coming out. Oh yeah, 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 oh yeah, oh yeah. Beauty is pain. Beauty is pain. Beauty is pain. Oh, that one hurt. Okay, so. My eyebrows are done. I can't remember if I showed you guys or not, but I took a shower, washed off my tan, and now we're gonna get ready, which is the fun part. So, don't really have anything specific that I wanna do, just to look cute. That's all. So, let's go. 
first thing we gotta do is prep the skin. So I'm going in with a hydrating essence and then my moisturizer and some under eye cream for these bags. Since I am tanned, I'm going to use two pumps of rosy beige and one pump of honey beige. Mix those together and get the color. Talking way too much with my hands now because um, I have nails on, so forgive me. It's a habit. Every time I get my nails done, I just talk all with my hands. Mixy, mixy, mixy. I'm actually almost out of the dark shade, so this may end up being too light on me. Definitely gonna be too light, but that is fine. Then I'm gonna go in with the lighter of the two foundation shades, stick that underneath my eyes, and then pat it in to warm it up and get me some. down one more to go. I'm like, the second lash is always worse. Scared. Scared, mom. I just 
remembered I turned 20 tomorrow. Get that foundation off. So I'm never gonna print to her. Okay. So y'all know, hair goes up and down. I washed it last night, so it's nice and clean, which may not be good for my girl's old. But that's okay, because at least it's clean. And then I'm just gonna spray it in. Spray in some heat protecting. Because. yesterday I loved it I hate it today with a passion but we're gonna make it work I put on some body shimmer it's my first excuse that I've had to wear it so I put it on my chest and then on my legs because my legs never like spray tan as good as my top does yeah, we're going to head to Campbell's. Brian Focused. There we go. Hi, Hi. What's up? 
because he's the best if you don't follow her, follow her. She's the best. You need to follow her if you live in Fort Myers and you need a picture, she's your gal. I'll link her Instagram below. <laughs> All right, we just got done with pictures. This is the second fit on. I don't even know if I showed you guys the full first fit on because it was just, I was a little bit of a hot mess. Um, she was, but she looked fabulous, of course. She rocked it. <laughs> so we are going to head out for dinner. We're going to an Italian restaurant. I'm super excited for that because I am so hungry and about to eat up some white pie that is going to wrap up my grad picks vlog i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below lots more graduation content is coming your way i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching and i'll see you soon